something. Good thing I remembered. Uh, so... Tattoo parlor location. Need to find a tattoo parlor. If Charlie had his tattoo... Ta tra blah, 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 tattoo done around here. Alright. We have to go find a tattoo parlor. That's what we're doing today. It's because you're a professional that I remembered to start the recording. Ine-san is always there for me. We're spending more than we're earning, which means that we're slowly losing money. If we keep this up, we're going to be flat broke. It's raining out. And we get some chill music. Damn that gotcha habit, yeah. The bane of my youthful existence. Ryo's such a tough kid, he doesn't need an umbrella. All the gel in his hair is enough to reflect the rain away from him. According to the old man who's always around here, there is a tattoo shop around here somewhere. So we'll just have to, we're gonna just have to go around and talk to people until we figure out where it is. Maybe this guy knows. Excuse me? Hi! Do you have time now, Hattori-san? Sure, what is it? I'm looking for a shop. Do you know if there's a tattoo parlor around here? Tattoo? You mean, a real tattoo? Yeah. Nah, I don't know of any. I see. Hey, Ryo, what do you want with a place like that? Oh, I'm just looking for someone. Is that so? Well now, you just be careful. Here? I'm sure a place like that wouldn't be a safe place to visit. I see. Now you may be noticing a strange stigma towards tattoos coming from this game. And that's because in Japan, tattoos are associated with gang violence. They still are to this day. They will- they won't let you into- into, like, public parks and stuff. Like, not like, like, walk your dog park, but like... Like... Splash Town. If you've got visible tattoos. Public baths will de will deny access to anyone with- with, uh... Visible tattoos. Stuff like that. Maybe this guy knows. Um, sorry, but could you come back a bit later? By the way, this dude's like queuing up a golf swing in his imagination. Excuse me. Sorry, I'm in a hurry. <laughs> okay, thank you, Kung Pao character. <laughs> I hadn't noticed you were in a hurry. Ono-san. Hey, Ryo. D 
Do you know of any tattoo parlors around here? Tat? Oh, right, tattoos. I heard there was a shop like that around here. Really? Do you know where it is? No idea. Oh, I know some of the bikers who come here sometimes have tattoos on their arms. Why don't you ask them? Where can I find them? I see them a lot in the arcade. The arcade? Thanks. Oh, yeah. All right, let's go to the arcade. Damn kids in their game boxes and headphones. Evil, you... Okay. You know what else is illegal in Japan? Gambling. you want I'd like to ask you about your tattoo you interested in tattoos yeah this tattoos our gang symbol where'd you get it at the best tattoo artist around where's that tattoo parlor by the look of those arms you look like you can hold your own in a fight I'll tell you what you want to know if you'll join our gang no, I'm not joining a gang. No. I got nothing to say to you then. This guy's a total loser! Um... What is it, kid? I need to ask you something. Forget it! Um... Who the hell do you think you're talking to? You fighting with me? I've got a question for you. I got nothing to say! I will hurt you! Bring it on, I'll beat the shit out of you. Isn't gotcha gambling? No. Gotcha is putting a quarter in a machine and getting a toy. You... You are guaranteed to get something. Alright, well that was some big help. I didn't want to join their gang just to find out where the tattoo shop was. Yo, this dude's open. I've never seen the store, o store open in the game yet. Is there a tattoo parlor in Dobuita? A tattoo parlor? Beats me. I see. Well, why don't you try someone else? Uh-huh. Yeah, I mean, it's like, a better example, Sky Knight, would be pachinko parlors, which are not gambling, quote-unquote. You play pachinko, and you get the little balls, which can then be exchanged for prizes. And then, the prizes can be given back to the pachinko company in exchange for money. Excuse me. It's a really, what really roundabout way. Do you know where a tattoo parlor is? A tattoo parlor? Hmm. I don't know of any. Ask someone else. Thanks. I'll do that. Grandma, you're, you need a young priest and an old priest. But yes, uh, there, there obviously you introduce laws banning something and people will find creative ways around it. But... You couldn't walk into a casino in Japan. They don't exist. The closest you'll get to a casino is Pachinko. Gotcha, what you're thinking of is... Like, actual, like, gotcha, like, little toy capsules is, is not a form of gambling. It's just, you put a quarter in a machine and get a toy. We have them in America. I used to use them all the time when I was a kid. Um, but Pachinko is a sort of game, quote-unquote. 
Oh my god, Adam, no one cares about Japan. We're playing a game that takes place in Japan. Anyway, so you get the little steel balls, and then you trade those for a prize, and then you trade the prize for money. That way it's not gambling, even though it is. Maybe Tom knows where I can get a tattoo. Tom. Hi, Ryo! Do you know of any tattoo parlors around here? Ryo, are you getting a tattoo? Uh-uh, I'm looking for someone. Sorry, I don't know of any tattoo parlors, man. Really? Ugh. Plinko, which is basically pachinko, yes. Super Mario Sunshine has a pachinko stage. When did Drew Carey start hosting Price is Right? Wait a minute, I think I just saw a sign on that door up here. But these are apartments. I've only seen a few Drew episodes in a few years. Okay, so recently. What is this place? Open to... Well, the design kind of looks like a tattoo. The old man did say there was a tattoo place around here. You don't think Drew Carey's funny? I liked him as the host of Who's Line for a little while. Tatsumi-san. Hey, what's up? Got a minute? Come back later, will you? I see. I'm currently trying to shove a burger and shake down my throat. In the rain. All right, let's go shopping. It's Kid Omega. Ome I don't know who that is. Hey, use where's the usual girl? Who the hell are you? Excuse me. What is it? Kondo-san, do you know any tattoo parlors? Afraid not. I see. Yeah, my knowledge of comic book characters isn't up there with my, like with my knowledge of Japan, for example. But, I'll... Pathetic. I'm sorry, it's... I'm just gonna be honest with you. I'm not really a big superhero guy. I don't want to go shopping here. The usual girl isn't here today. Ooh, maybe this dude knows. Excuse me? Yes? What's the matter? I'm looking for a shop. Do you know where any tattoo parlors are? Tattoo parlors? Uh-uh. Don't know any. I see. Hey, wait a minute. Speaking of tattoos... Yeah? I saw some men with tattoos hanging out at the motorcycle shop. Why don't you ask them? The motorcycle shop? Oh no, son's place. Thank you. All right, we'll try asking them. They don't come around until it gets like kind of dark out, though. So I'll ask them. I also want to check this this building up here, whatever this is, which opens at like two o'clock, I think. Who are you? Um. Yes. What is it? There's something I need to ask you. Sorry, but. You see, I have something to do. 
I understand. See you later. Lady, I need you to get out of my way. So how are you guys today? Yep, two o'clock. I'm gonna have a jet cola. Not mad enough to chug it in one go. On my way to work today, my left eye froze closed. Kurita-san. Yo, how are ya? Know of any tattoo parlors around here? Tattoo parlors? You know, man, I heard there's one around. Don't know where it is, though. I see. Man, a lot of people don't... Uh, know anything about tattoo parlors. Excuse me. Hey! I'm looking for a tattoo parlor. Tattoo? I thought about getting one once. I see. You what? Know where I can find one? Hmm? Nah. I looked, but couldn't find one. I see. Sorry. Come back when you get your tattoo. Huh? I'll set you up with a great-looking jacket. What, Sky Knight? Yes, my, my left eye froze shut on my way to work today. Frame from doing that from now on. I didn't do it on purpose. I don't. Wh I, what do you want me to do? Buy some goggles to wear when I walk to work? What do I. Do I have food for the cat? I do. Alright, cool. Well, I don't think I'm gonna lose my eye, but. Yeah, I can't tell you how many times I've had, like, the, the water of my eyes freeze on the way to work. This time was the worst, though, because my left eye, I couldn't get it to open. I think I need my eyes, evil. Let me rephrase that. I think I need at least one uh, one eye at any given moment. They're doing amazing things with cybernetics these days. 
Well, if I could get a cybernetic eye or two, then sure. Or even, you know, like I'd take a cybernetic hand. Sure, sign me up. You could game with Braille. I wouldn't want to do that. If I lost both my eyes, I'd be done being a streamer. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I don't feel that dedicated to ASMR streaming. To want to make a living off of it, or attempt to. Imagine... Wait, is this a pachinko parlor? Imagine only being an ASMR streamer. Like, that's all you do. Holy shit. Oh yeah, that's right. This game takes place before gambling was outlawed. Fuck, gambling was still legal when this game takes place. 20 tokens for 100 yen. How many will I use? How do I- how do I use, play a slot machine? Wait, 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 wait. Game over. Guess I'll try it again. How many will I use? Alright, fuck it. Put a thousand yen in this thing. This is how we're gonna make money. So the, the more you bet, the more chances there are of of getting a payout. Is that what is that what's happening? I find that cranial nerve Nerve exams relax me more than most of that other crap that's ASMR. Oh, that's- yeah, you know, it's funny, but I actually saw you start up Dead by Daylight. It's okay, often when I watch streams, I have them on in the background while I do other stuff. That's how I enjoy streams. I'm not going to make any of my money back. Fuck. I just wanted to make more than I spent. God damn it. That's how they get you. <laughs> 
Listen, no wonder Japan outlawed this shit in like 10 years from now. Oh, there we go. There we go. Big money. Come on, big money. God damn it. Big money, come on. Alright, this is my last spin. God damn it. All right. Game over. Game over. We can't play anymore. We can't play anymore. That's enough for now. Besides, it's it's too late. We have to go get We have to go go to that building. Man, I can't I can't believe I figured out a way to gamble my my money away even faster. I wish they had blackjack. Then, then I would get rich quick. I love me some blackjack. I'd be walking out of there with a couple thousand yen. Oh, I think I found the tattoo parlor. Something tough, so no one will mess with me. Yeah, <laughs> like that schoolboy. Shut up! He kicked your butt too. That schoolboy. Is a certain someone a card a card counter? No, I'm not a card huh? counter. I just I just Is enjoy him? blackjack. Uh, uh, oh, I'm no. out of here. Have you come for a tattoo? I'm looking for a guy named Charlie. He's over there. He's sleeping. Wouldn't wake him, unless you want to get hurt. I can count to 21, evil. What the? Fuck. Damn. We try again. Oh, good. What the? The wrong one. What do you want? I want to know about the cartel. I don't know. Why do you want to know? That's none of your business. Just tell me. Okay, let me go. I'll tell you. I'll arrange for you to meet some of them, okay? You didn't need to rip my arm off. Okay, so when? Tomorrow at three. Wait at the arcade. I have your word? Yeah. You know what I'll do if you don't show? Don't fuck with Rio. Alright, so we're going to the arcade tomorrow. Um, Sky Knight, I'd like to point out... You would never hit on 17. I got the reference, we were watching a cutscene. It's from the first Austin Powers movie, when he meets number two. Hi, Rio. Nozomi, what are you doing here? Class just got out. You shouldn't be around here. But I was looking for you. Oh? My friend said she saw you down here. But I didn't why? say beat, I said meet. Today we had our college orientation, but you weren't there. Yeah. Have you decided where to go? Not yet, but if I go, it'll have karate. It's about time you started studying for the entrance exams. 
Yeah, I know. I'm worried about you. And with exams... I'll be fine. Ryo, I understand what you're going through with your father and all, but... We can talk about it later. Promise? Yeah, it's dangerous here. You should go home. See you later. He likes you, Ryo. Stop being so dense. Anyway, we gotta go to the arcade tomorrow at 3. Anyway, um... And... He doesn't bust in that scene, Evil. He doesn't mm. draw enough cards. Hi. The dealer How's keeps saying, going? I suggest you What's hit, wrong? sir, and then I'm he says, so thirsty. I, I also drink, like to live dangerously. But I don't have any change. Because he keeps saying, I'll stay. I'll buy you one. What do you want? You're really nice. Thanks. What kind of drink do you recommend? Hmm. Let's see. Evil, don't make me embarrass you. Here, have a coffee. Hmm. Here. Thanks a lot. You've made my day. Is the restaurant busy? Ah, uh, a little. You should come by again. And try Tao San special. Yes, please give my regards to Tao San. Sure thing. I'll say hi for you. Okay, I've got to go. Got things to do. Okay, see you. Thanks again. Dude, you gotta earn some money so you can buy your own drinks. All right, here we go. We're putting on the scene. Austin Powers does not bust. He doesn't draw enough cards. You got that one right. But I got the line right. Well, I wasn't trying to quote the line. I didn't remember the line. No, 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 no. The, the, the dealer does say, I suggest you hit, sir. That's the line I quoted. Yes, he does. I'm putting it on. I'm putting... Don't underestimate how many times I've seen Austin Powers. This video is really good quality. At 240p. Excuse me. <laughs> Do you mind if I join you? Not at all. Game is blackjack, gentlemen. Ten thousand dollars minimum bet. A king for you, sir, and a three for you. Seventeen. <laughs> Hit me. You have 17, sir. I like to live dangerously. Four. 21. Five. I'll stay. I suggest you hit, sir. I also like to live dangerously. As you wish, sir. Twenty beats your five. I'm sorry, sir. Well, I won't lie to you. Cards are not my bag, baby. <clears throat> hmm. 
<laughs> Take a big swig. All I have today is water. Which is sad, but I got I got water. I could watch the Austin Powers movies in my mind. That's how many times I've seen them. Salami? I was hoping there'd be more food I could get for the cat here. I don't want to feed it squid legs every time. Yeah, that's... that sounds like some uh, cosmic horror. Alright, well, we have to- we have to kill time until tomorrow. I mean, I could just go back home and go to bed, but... I don't really want to just waste a day of the game without accomplishing anything. Maybe we could do something at the dojo. Actually, you know what? Let's check on the cat now. Hey, there's a there's a boy here today. No, no, no. Talk to the kid. Rio, talk to the kid. Hi, Kota. Hi there. Where are you going? It's a secret. Is that right? Don't stay out too late. Okay. Uh, okay. You hungry? Here. Don't eat the stick. Yo! Look! She's eating it! Yeah, she should get better soon. Yeah! Why has no one drowned the cat yet? Because, evil, most people like cats. I don't know what you have against cats. I love cats, but I'm allergic to them. Which is why I'll settle for my favorite animal, snakes. Because they don't have hair. Snakes are just as adorable as cats, in my opinion. Are you a member of the Church of Satan? Me? Why? Because I like snakes? Listen, I understand snakes aren't everyone's thing, but I think they're adorable. In March, I will be getting a snake. 
and it will be joining us on stream once in a while. Ine-san. Ryo-san. Also, do make more of an effort to return home as early as possible. I will try my best. See you later, Ine-san. Yes. Hey, I'm... It's six and I'm home. Relax. Open the fridge. Ine-san. Ryo-san. I don't wish to meddle, but please don't do anything reckless. Okay, thanks. For See Friday later, Fright Sun. Night? Sure, yes. yeah. I mean, that's the only stream where I have webcam on. But, like, if I'm holding my snake while I'm streaming, I might turn the webcam on for a second so that it can say hi. That's all I'm saying. Obviously, if too many people are, are afraid of snakes, then I won't, but... I don't think you're so scared of snakes that you couldn't look at one on a computer screen. I mean, maybe you are. Yeah, we can't even go to bed yet if we wanted to. Yo, this room is chill. Yo, Virtua Fighter. Whose room is this? Shadow Reaper. I just learned a new move. Thanks, I guess. Okay, so you don't care if they're not actually right in front of you. Snakes snakes look like they're always smiling. I think that's what I like about them. Hey, yo, this dude's here. No, no, no stop putting your shoes on and off. Folks on. Yeah. About the men in black suits. Yo, son. I've been hearing a lot of rumors about you. Rumors? That you've joined some gang and are getting into fights. Don't worry about it. What do you mean? Let them say whatever they want to say. But Ine-san is worried too. You don't need to worry about me. Uh... I don't know when the earliest the game will let us go to bed is. Evil, what's your opinion on snakes? Father, I promise to avenge you. Okay, we got a little cutscene. Yo-san! Let's spar for a bit, huh? 
It's been a while. All right. Let's go. That was a good one. Whoa, whoa! Alright, well, some free, um, fighting practice. That's the Fuku-san I know. since we practiced together. I feel much better now. H have you found something? I've got a lead on the Chinese cartel. Are they the same ones who, who killed Hazuki-sensei? I don't know yet. You're not thinking of going after them alone, are you? You go up against those killers? It's my only option. I know how you feel, but it's too dangerous. Even Sensei couldn't. I've made up my mind. But what if something happens to you? I feel responsible. Don't worry about me. No. Ryo-san, is that why you started training? Those eyes. <sighs> oh, please. I'm begging you. Please think it over. My mind is made up. I must go. Ryo-san! Ine-san, you overheard? Please don't pursue this, Ryo-san. Hello, Gear to... Joe. Please step aside. I'm begging you. Respect Hazuki-sensei's will and look after the dojo. I can't believe my father killed someone. Do-san. Please wait. There's something I must give to you. A letter? To my father? This came right after Hazuki-sensei passed away. I had a bad feeling about it, so I felt I should keep it hidden until today. This letter's in Chinese, but why? Because I didn't want you to do anything foolish and risk your life. And because I don't want you to upset the spirit of your father. Please, make a promise to me. Inesa. Please, I need you to promise me. Yes, I promise. To kick their asses. Thank you, Dio-san. Alright, well, we can sleep. Tomorrow we'll go to the arcade. Ine-san gave me a letter written in Chinese. Nozomi seems to be worried about me. Meet Charlie at U Arcade. 3 p.m. Alright. Let's go do that. I do not uh, speak uh, Chinese. Today's allowance. Time to go blow it at the arcade. Ryo-san, what were you talking about with Ine-san? 
Well... Is that a letter? In Chinese? Dude, you're gonna get it soaked. Get it out of the rain. Is it from the man who murdered Sensei? I don't know. Damn it! If only we knew someone who reads Chinese! Thank God he had the foresight to write it in waterproof ink. Exactly. Now, the funny thing is, that cutscene could have been triggered on any day. So it's just a coincidence that it was triggered on a day that the game was raining. Be you know, because this game renders cutscenes in real time. The, the current time and weather are reflected in the cutscenes. Alright, you get to f have some more food, I guess. The squid legs didn't keep you full for very long. Want some food? She's eating! She must have been very hungry. Yeah, and she looks real happy. Thank you, dear. Gotta take care of the cat. Wait, is the cat still hungry? I need to buy the cat quality cat food. Alright, I'm gonna go buy it some fish. To feed it next time I come through. What's wrong? I'm gonna kick his ass. At the construction site. You. Isn't it a little I early? You couldn't resist, boy. What? Remember the tattoo parlor? Payback time. Here, catch. Go home. What? What? All right. Time to kick some ass. Chinese? Yes. My name's Xiao Gong. What's your name? Ryo. Ryo Hazuki. Ryo Hazuki. Yeah. Say say Ryo san. Wait, I need I need your language skills to read me this letter that is probably written in very very old Chinese. Mandarin. Excuse me. Where'd that kid go? Helped out a Chinese boy named Gao Wen. This letter's my only lead now. I'm sure it will reveal the next step, but who can read this letter for me? Well, where's that kid? Let's go check... Uh, the park, maybe?
Wait a minute. No, that's not him. Uh, he probably is going to have a soccer ball when we find him, so. There's nobody at the park right now. Where'd that kid go? I guess I don't have to go to the arcade. Maybe he's not out because it's raining. Whoa, 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 wait a minute, wait a minute. Are you guys seeing this? I think I just found like a slip in time. Alright, from from here, there's a girl standing there with an umbrella. You ready for this shit? No, she's still there. Where'd the fucking- where'd that boy come from? Now there's two people there. What is happening? Hold on. Uh, okay. Maybe I'm just crazy. Alright, well, I suppose we could ask around some of the Chinese shops we went to earlier. See if any of them know how to read the letter. Excuse me. Hello, Ryo. Would you read this letter for me? I think it's in Chinese. Uh... Hmm? What does it say? I'm sorry. I can't read it at all. There are so many strange characters, you know? I see. Dude looked like he smoked... <laughs> ...a lot of weed before I got here. Did you see his face? Vaping wasn't invented yet, so it was either cigarettes or... ...or weed. Uh, where else? There's a Chinese restaurant this way. Guess they're not open yet. Time to the open. The sheer emotion displayed in this game is amazing. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's a little silly, but I like it. Oh yeah, there's this place. The Aji Ichi. Tao-san, have you got a minute? Yes? What is it? 
I was wondering whether you could translate this letter for me. Oh no, there are a lot of old kanji characters. And it's written in an unusual way. What does it say? I'm sorry. I can't read it. Oh, really? Right? Oh, yeah, really. But this kind of paper is used for ceremonial purposes in Chinese calligraphy. Ceremonial purposes? Tao-san, what ceremonial purposes? It's the top quality grade of paper. It's used for fine calligraphy. It's also used for ceremonial cooking. To wrap around sea bass, it's very famous. But you can't read it? No, we can't. Oh, but Guangxi might be able to. Huh? Ask Guangxi. He's out delivering on the shopping street. He's good with kanji characters. I got it. I'll try him. They do seem a little sus, but I think he was asking if his wife could read it. But, who knows, it was a little sus. I'm, I'm chopping it up to bad translation. Or, not always 100% great translation. Uh, so we're looking for the dude. I think we're looking for the dude that we buy drinks for sometimes. He's somewhere. Hi, Lo. Oh. Hi, Go Wang. Come on, let's play. Next time, okay? I'm kind of busy now. By the way, Go Wang, you're Chinese, aren't you? Yup. I'm looking for somebody who can read a letter written in Chinese. My grandmother can. Your grandmother? About your grandmother? Her name is Sha Shui. She's real nice. Where is she? At the shop. Shop? What shop? She sells dishes and stuff. Um... The China it's shop. It's called Roxia. You mean Loxia China shop, right? The roof is red. I'll go see her. Thanks. Telling me the color of the roof isn't really going to help me find the shop, but I appreciate the sentiment, kid. Rusia. Where is Rusia? I'm sure we've run into it. Is it this place? No, that's Manpuku. Manpuku and Ramen in Siberia. Well, if it's in Siberia, I don't think we're getting there. Asia Travel Company. I don't think that's what I'm looking for. Also, I've never come back here. Is there anything? No. Okay. Can I go in this door? I want to break into the burger joint. Steal a burger. Fortune teller. Ah, here we go. help you excuse me are you Xiaosun yes that's right and you are I'm Ryo Hazuki ah uh, Hazuki-san oh yes my grandson go and told me thank you very much Mm -hmm. You helped him at Sakuragaoka. 
Oh, I remember. He was so excited when he told me. He now aspires to grow strong and brave, just like you. It was nothing, really. <laughs> so, what brings you here? Well, I have a letter I'd like you to translate. Okay. Reversed kanji. Reversed? Yes, but they aren't just reversed left to right. They're written in a special style. Could you read it for me? Yes, of course. Beware of those who pursue the mirror. If you ever need help, seek the aid of Master Chen. Ju Yuan Da. Ju Yong Da. Master Chen? Oh, there's something written on the back, too. Tian Ji Fu, Jiao Tao Long, Ti Ji Mu, Wo Da Yo. What does it mean? Father's Heaven, Nine Dragons, Mother's Earth, Comrades. I'm sorry, it doesn't make sense. I understand. But I think this part may be a phone number. These ancient characters are numbers. A phone number? Yes. 04686156767. Zero four six eight six one five six four, right? I've got it. Call that number now. Thank you very much. Uh, call the number, use the phone. Wait, I didn't write the number down. Actually, I'm pretty sure he does write numbers down. Phone numbers... Um, tell me he wrote the number down. Oh, okay, he did write it down. Ooh, I got scared for a second. 04686-6164. Somebody write that in the chat for me. <laughs> Ringing. They want to know if we would like to extend our car insurance warranty. Say yes. OMG, I am in a food coma. How are you typing? Also, I gotta turn my heater up because it's it's cold in my apartment right now. I'll be right back. I've got my heater turned up to 86 degrees because it's so fucking cold out today. It's been in the negatives all day. All right, uh, public phone. There's a public phone around here somewhere. I remember walking by it. I mean, we probably use the phone at home too, but we can just use this one. But there was something else. Father's Heaven, Nine Dragons, Mother's Earth, Comrades. Okay, I'm writing this number down in the chat so that I can just not have to remember it.
no. There we go. Zero. Four. Six. Eight. Six. <laughs> One. Thanks for writing the number down, evil. Five, six, four. Nine dragons. Nine dragons. Warehouse number eight. Warehouse number eight? You. Who are you? Isn't this the Chen residence? Oops. Simulation fun and engaging? That's warehouse number eight. Are you being sarcastic, Sky Knight? Are you saying this game is boring? Uh, okay, so Father's Heaven is a password. I need to locate warehouse number eight. Warehouse number eight. Okay. Now we gotta go ask around town and find out where warehouse number eight is. 50 50 in my books so far. It's between warehouses seven and nine. Thank you, evil. Dialing a phone manually may be boring as hell. Yeah, but here's the thing. I I can use that phone to call all of these numbers. I could call the police if I wanted to and do like a prank call. It's not that, I mean, yeah, I guess it's kind of boring, but it's like the game has a fully functioning phone system in it. Just, just for shits and giggles. Why have the player dial those numbers manually? Because you do everything else in this game manually. Akasakasa. Hi, Leo. Ever heard of a warehouse number eight? Warehouse number eight? Never heard of it. I see. Why are you looking for a warehouse? Uh, just am. Yeah, I get what you're saying, Sky Knight. I, in fact, I'm gonna go use the phone some more. I don't know, I, I like it. I think it's fun having to do everything, having, making the player do everything on their own. Alright, let's see here. Uh, maybe we could use number assistance to track where the warehouse is? One. Oh. Hello, 104 directory information. I'd like for you to tell me the address of phone number 61564. I am terribly sorry, but it's not possible to look up an address from a telephone number. They knew. It's probably the number for a place called Warehouse Number 8. I'm terribly sorry, but it's not possible to use a telephone number to look up an address. I see. Well, thanks. Thank you very much. It's not that it's not possible, it's just that they won't. I'm calling the police. What was the police phone number? 119? I'm too old to make crank calls. The game knew. 420. Alright, we'll call 420. It's 110. Alright, hold on. 
<laughs> no, it doesn't, that's not a number. Also, I just realized I can open my... Uh... My... Journal while using the phone. Just stop. Just the let me... Number you have dialed. All right. All right. One, one, zero. Last number we're calling. I don't want the police involved. They got me an achievement called Appropriate Response. Coward. It's not my fault. Alright, uh, well, we can't find out where the warehouse is with the number, so... I guess we're gonna have to just ask around. Guys, I think we're almost on disc two of this game. Um, hi. What can I get for you? Have you heard of a warehouse number eight? A warehouse? Nope. I have no idea. I see. I don't trust that dude's smile. Excuse me. What can I get for you, Ryo? Do you have time now, Hattori-san? What is it? Do you know where a warehouse number eight is? A warehouse number eight? No, I don't know. I see. What about that warehouse? Uh, nothing. Well, thanks anyway. What? Okay, see ya. What? Come on, somebody's got to know where warehouse number eight is. Take that guy's glasses. Evil, why do you want me to be mean to everybody? Oh, no, son. Hey, Ryo! Do you know where a warehouse number eight is? No, I don't. I see. Okay. Um. What do you want? I need to ask you something. I got nothing to say to you. Um. Who the hell do you think you're talking to? You fighting with me? I've got a question for you. I told you! Forget it! Get out of here! I don't think these guys are gonna tell me where warehouse number eight is. I guess I could ask people at like a bar or something. Maybe sailors would know. Nozomi. Yo. You got a minute? Yeah. Oh, no. I changed my mind. What? You don't trust me? I'm sorry. So talk to me. Yeah. <laughs> I'm looking for a warehouse number eight. Warehouse number eight? Yeah. Any idea where it is? Don't you have any clues? Just a letter and a phone number. Why don't you try getting the address from the letter and the phone number? Oh, yeah. Pretty helpful, aren't I? No. Um, I gotta go. Because I tried that and it didn't work. Get the address from the phone number. Use your limit break. Omaiwomo Shinderu. I'm gonna go try one more time. Because I did have some dialogue options when I tried that.
one zero four the same thing will happen okay <laughs> all right never mind then at least the game doesn't let you waste your time I was more worried it was going to be one of those instances of I couldn't do it yet because I didn't know I was supposed to. But no, the the game doesn't treat you doesn't treat the player that way. Uh okay. Maybe maybe one of the dudes down here knows. Uh what can I get for you? I'm looking for a place called warehouse number 8. Have you ever heard of it? Sorry, I can't remember. I see. Can't remember or don't want to remember. Maybe Tom knows. Tom? Hi! You're looking good. Yeah, I'm always grooving, man. If I move, more customers may come. Yeah, sure. Keep it grooving, man. Hey. Hey, Rio! How's everything? Hey, Rio, how about a dog? No, thanks. Maybe next time. I guess Rio's not even gonna bother asking him. Kurita-san. Yo, how are ya? I'm looking for a warehouse number eight. Warehouse number eight? Never heard of it. Why are you looking for a warehouse? No reason. Itoi-san. Yes. Do you know of a warehouse number eight? Warehouse number eight? Afraid I don't know much of anything about warehouses. I see. <laughs> what what a way to to phrase that. Excuse me. Hi. What can I get you? Do you know about warehouse number eight? Sorry. I don't think I know the place. I see. This is like human interactions recreated by aliens. That's how this feels sometimes. Nemoto-san. Ah! Hello, Ryo! Do you know of a warehouse number eight? Hmm... Afraid not. I see. Nobody knows. No, 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 no. I don't want to use the phone. No. Cancel. You just wasted your money. I want to talk to the lady. Hi, Hirata-san. Ah, hi there, yo. Do you know where warehouse number eight is? What? Firehouse number eight? No, warehouse number eight. Hmm. Don't believe I've ever heard of it before. I have the phone number, but... Well then, why don't you try looking in the phone book? The address might be listed. Yeah. Do you have a phone book I could use? Where am I gonna get a phone book? Guys, help. Where do you go in the 80s to get a phone book? A phone booth. Fine. <laughs> we'll see if there's a phone book at the phone booth. I feel like that would be too convenient. Also, I do know disc 2 
uh, takes place in a different location than the the city that we've start been been in for the beginning of the game. So we are going to get a change of scenery here soon. I imagine I don't see a phone book in there, man. You guys lied to me. Mishima-san. Oh, hello, Dio. Would you know where a warehouse number eight is? Warehouse number eight? I'm afraid I don't. Is that so? Nobody knows. I bet the people who come out late at night would know. No more, son. Oh, Dio. Hello. Do you know of a warehouse number eight? Number eight? That means there are number one to number seven as well? Gee, thanks, I guess Evil. So. so the place must be pretty big. Sorry, no idea. I see. I wasn't saying that to chat. I was just saying that to the dude I was talking to because he's like, must be a warehouse one through eight. Just sounded like something evil would say. That's all. Selective realism. Yeah. It is a game from the Dreamcast era. Like... Didn't he say it earlier? I, yeah, I think he said... No, no, no. He said Warehouse 8 is between Warehouses 7 and 9. Excuse me. I don't got time to talk to you. Bye. Okay. I need like the bars to open so the the, the late night people they might know where the warehouse would be. What is this place? Kara sushi. Oh hell yeah, I could go for some sushi. I'm not wrong. What if there are no other warehouses? Then you would be wrong. Um try again when you get a bit older. Sorry. Uh Lady, I think you have the wrong idea. Shinkichi-san, do you have a minute? Sure, what's on your mind? Have you heard of a warehouse number eight? Warehouse? Never heard of it. Number eight ought to tell you they're number one, number two, etc., right? Just that alone isn't much to go on there, Ryo. I see. Sorry, Dio. That's okay. I like this uh, guy, says Evil. What is it? What can I get for you? That's okay. You're missing out. I got some excellent fish in today. Sorry. I'll see you later then. Hey. Hi! How's everything? Yeah, I'm always good. Yeah, sure. I wish we could ask Tom. I bet Tom knows. That is an amazing level of confidence. <laughs> or she's just extremely self-centered, Sky Knight. That's the other solution. Excuse me. Hey, do you know of a warehouse number eight? Oh, a warehouse district? A warehouse district? Yeah, but I forgot. Where was it? God damn it, dude. Selective memory is what these people have. Tamurasa. Hey. I'm looking for warehouse number 8. I've already tried calling 104, but they didn't know. That's strange. 104 can usually tell you what the number is. Try asking again. They must be able to tell you the region, at least. That's right. Oh, uh, shit. Now do I have to go do it again? Or is that just bullshit advice? Hold on, there's a phone right over here. That was probably just some bullshit advice. 
like Zelda 2 advice. Oh, thank God she left the phone out. Oh, there's a phone book right here. I just didn't see it before, because the camera kept zooming in on the old lady. 61. 61. Got it. 61. It's an Amihama. Amihama. Which is... Is for Amihama. So, okay. How do I get to Amihama? Excuse me. Hey! Do you know Amihama? Huh? What about Amihama? The harbor, right? Yeah. When I was young, well, I'm still young, but when I was a bit younger, I worked at the harbor. Now that was a tough job. Okay, the harbor. How do we get to the harbor? I should talk to some more people. Okay. Amihama. Who's this lady? Eddie. What? Dio? Hey. Oh, yeah. Dio? Huh? Hey, I bought a new camera the other day. It's the kind you don't have to take to the shop to get the film developed. That's cool. You only have to aim and shoot, and then the photo comes out. I'll take a picture of you and Nozomi with it sometime. No, that's okay. Sure it is. And you'd better cooperate. Hey. What? Do you know where Amihama is? Oh? You going to the harbor? Hey, why don't you take Nozomi with you? The seaside is so romantic. Well... What do you mean, well? What is with you? Pay more attention to Nozomi. Hey. It Stop pestering me. I'm busy right now. Don't talk to me. Sorry. Rio is a regular cloud strife sometimes. Itoi-san. Yes. It's about Amihama. Yeah, I've been there. But it was a long time ago and I don't go there these days. What kind of a place was it, anyway? Hermit the Frog voice acts this old man. Kurita-san. Yo, how are ya? Do you know where Amihama is? Huh? The harbor area. But why? Is Amihama down by the harbor? Amihama is the harbor. Man, anybody interested in the military knows that. Whenever the Navy submarines are in port, you can get close-up shots of them. Want to take a look while you're here? Next time. Okay, so we have to go down to the harbor. Tom. Hi, Dio. Can you tell me the way to Amihama? Sure, the harbor, right? Take a bus from the main street straight down there. I see. Thanks. For once, Tom was the man we needed to go to. The bus stop for Amihama is near the tobacco shop. Can I go go to Amihama right now? Or do I have to wait till tomorrow? Oh fuck, hold on. What time is it right now? Like, not, like, I can see the time in the top right corner, but like, what day of the week is it?
Monday, Monday, okay. Weekdays. What is this saying to me? <laughs> what? Oh, oh, uh... Evil, what are you saying? The bus is here. <laughs> I, 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 okay. Can I get on the bus? Alright, I guess we're going to Amihama. We're going to a new area. I spent so long trying to figure out the, the timetable on the bus there that I the bus showed up. Well, it looks like we've made our way to the second area of the game. So, uh, where is warehouse number eight? Let's ask this man. Uh, could you tell me where warehouse number eight is? It's behind the lunchbox stand. At the front of the warehouse district. It's a huge warehouse, so you can't miss it. Gotcha. Thanks. Hey, you! I said hand over all your money! Hmm? Oh, shit. I don't have no more! Please, let me be! Oh, uh, th it's this huh? punk. No more! Don't mess with me! Stop it! And just who are you? Don't you know that blackmail is way uncool? Thinks you stuff, eh? Eh, Nyo Hazuki from Suka High! Hazuki? Yeah? So what? I ain't afraid of him! I can take this geek! Evil, I don't know what the wombat wombats are, I'm sorry. You're no match for me! Hey! Hey, you! Wait! Damn! Think you can make a fool out of me, asshole? Oh, you've had it now! What? So, this is the famous Nyo Hazuki. Oh, how sad! Fuck! Why are you shocked, evil? Way to go, bro! Or are you being sarcastic? Told ya I could take that geek! Fuck. Stop it! And just who are you? Don't you know that blackmail is way uncool? Thinks you stuff, eh? Eh? New Hazuki All right, I gotta focus. <laughs> Hazuki! Yeah? So what? I ain't afraid of him. I can take this geek! Gah! Dorosan! <laughs> hey! Hey, you! Wait! Damn! Oh, you've had it now! Ouch! Much better. After all, what, what? I have a question. Sure, what is it? Warehouse number eight, where is it? Yeah, yeah. 
down this street, there's a new warehouse district. Turn right, and number eight should be there. So it's straight, and to the right. That's it! Well, uh, time for us to go! The most unsuccessful delinquents I've ever met in my life. Straight into the right. Number one through eleven. Alright, here we go. There's there's number eight. Excuse me. Got business here? Um, well a bit. You could be mistaken for a thief or a trespasser at this time of night. You'd better go on home as soon as possible. Th thanks. What about a hooligan? Basically the same thing. Is there... A way for me to get in? Here we go. It's locked. How shocking. That did say 8 on the front, right? Here we go. Excuse me. Got business here? Um, I hear it. If you don't have business... Well, alright. I found the warehouse. Can't do anything with it. Excuse me. Yes, what is it? Where is warehouse number eight? Oh, when you're looking for a particular warehouse, be sure and check the walls. The numbers of each warehouse are written there. All right. Okay. All right, well, this is definitely warehouse number eight. So now what? No other warehouse number eight. Oh shit, hold on. Is that an open window up there? It's look, it's between seven and nine. Just where I said it was. Yes, evil, you're you were right. All along How do I... I gotta get up to that window. It's locked. Kick it in. I wish I could. What? 
Okay. I just kind of feel like it's not registering that I've found Warehouse 8. Are you supposed to come here at a certain time? I'm maybe, yeah. It might be too late. It might be too late. Alright, let's go look around elsewhere. Maybe there's somewhere I can sleep here? Or maybe I have to go back home? I don't I don't know. Harbor Lounge. Maybe I could, uh, maybe I can sleep, sleep there. I live at the harbor now, Grandma. I'm sorry. In a van by the river. Yeah. It's getting really late. Yes, it is. <laughs> Arbor Cafeteria. Arbor Lounge. Can I can I hang out here? They're already closed. I guess I got to just go back home. All right, fine. I'll come back early tomorrow. Now, I'm hoping the game unlocks this as a fast travel spot. Just... That would be nice. While we wait for the bus, let me play that other Red Vox song I wanted to show off. No, 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 get on the bus. I'm gonna get home at, like, midnight. It's this 
it's late already. I should go home. I'm gonna get grounded and I won't be able to avenge my father. Sure not to waste this. So yeah, that was uh, the more you win by Red Vox. Duosan, are you going out? Yeah. You were late returning home last night. Yes, a little. I would appreciate it if you could come home by eleven. Okay, I understand. What was the song about? I, I don't know. You want? <laughs> Let's break it down. Break it down for me. Uh, it, actually, I can tell you what the song is about. It's about people making more money off the things you do than you. Here, well, let's 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 listen to this song uninterrupted by game audio, real quick. It's catchy and has a has a message. You're getting an inch while they're taking a mile. So that's the first nod towards what I was talking about. To me, it sounds like a song about the struggles of just making it in life.
and like no matter what kind of work you do the people above you make more money off your work than you do Alright, I'm here nice and early this time. Viva la revolution. Yeah. <laughs> I'm really sticking it to the man. So if I'm reading this right, the next bus should show up at 9.30. Uh, one of my favorite Red Vox songs, which I'll share... I'll share it during the stream. It'll be the last song we share during the stream today. But it's called Pale Blue Dot, and the meaning of that one is a little bit more easily discernible. Let's try going to that warehouse now that it's early. Also, it's been raining for days now. Yo, what's this lady over here doing? Hisakasa. Well. I need to go to warehouse number eight, but... Oh, number eight? It's right behind here. Do you have some business at the warehouse? Well, sort of. So it's right behind here. Thanks a lot. I was kind of hoping I'd get, like, a lunch. Evil, did you... Are you trying to set me off with that comment? a prohibited area. You can't be here without authorization. No, I'm stating a fact. I wonder if there's another way in. But you... Uh, you said parts of Korea are rainy, as though this takes place in Korea. An open window. I'll need to boost myself up there. Oh, Japan, whatever. That's why I asked if you were trying to set- See, I just thought you did it on purpose. Well, it gets rainy here in Maine like this, too, where it'll just rain for days. But, um... I think it's just a, a common thing that happens in coastal areas. There must be some information here. Alright, we're breaking and, breaking and entering. This this is like the first time in this game we've we've actively like broken the law. This looks like an office. What are these cigarettes? 
Hell yeah. There's a lot of smokers. Aside from the assaults. I we, wonder if there are any clues here. We could argue that those assaults were all in self-defense, though. An invoice for warehouse number eight? This must be the right place. Off to court we go, yeah. Hopefully Phoenix Wright is our lawyer. A pen. I wonder what time the workers are coming back. Hopefully not anytime soon. There probably aren't any clues here. My dad used to uh, tell me I should be a lawyer, but... I shouldn't touch them. Because of my, um... I'd better not mess with this. This looks difficult to read. Because of my... reputation for... <laughs> being difficult to argue with. Um, did you object? No. Honestly... I, I, I think being a lawyer would be interesting. The problem is, I don't really care to, like, take the time... I hear voices. Is someone there? ...to go to college and pass the bar and... When you look at this invoice, the address is wrong. So it is. I've asked them a million times to get it right. Yeah, it says right here, Old Warehouse District. What are they thinking? Can you call over to the Old Warehouse number 8? Okay, got it. So there's another warehouse number eight. There is another warehouse number eight. I'll need to find the old warehouse district. All right. Time to find the old warehouse number eight. Adam doesn't want to have to learn to read and all that. Evil, how am I reading chat right now? I just had a- I had a miserable experience in school, and I- I didn't really want to subject myself to more school. So any career that required more school, I was all set with. Probably have a text-to-voice program. You would hear it if I did. Hisakusa. We are. I need to get to the old warehouse district, but- The old warehouse district? It's just up the street. Great. Thank you very much. You have been the most helpful character so far this entire game. Uh, Sky Knight, what are you referencing? Yo, Tom. Tom. Hi, Dio. Have you heard of the old warehouse district? The old warehouse district? No, never heard of it, man. Really? Do you know anyone who might know about it? Maybe Hisaka-san can help you. Hisaka-san? She sells lunch boxes near the warehouses. She's way over there. I see. I'll ask her. I asked her already. <laughs> I'm heading in the direction she told me to go in. It's got to be here. Hey, wait. This area is prohibited. No unauthorized personnel. Go on, get out. Yeah. If only school had been that much fun, Sky Knight. Got to wait till tonight. Oh, now we have to wait till it's late. Alright, can we go fishing? Should get Glenn Danzing to play Adam in his movie. Why? I want to be played by... Um... Peter Dinklage. Big 
sis. Hi, Mai. What is it? Let me some money. No way. Why not? Come on, lend me some. I said no. I know you'd only waste it. Prude! See if I ask you any more. My. <sighs> He's like a son. Hi, Dio. What's wrong? Mai's hanging with a bad crowd and treating our family bad. She wasn't like that before. Really? Liu, could you talk to her? She won't listen to me at all. Me? Yes, considering you've known her since she was young. Please, talk to her. Alright, I guess. I'll try. Really? It'd help me out. Okay. She's somewhere in the harbor, behind the warehouses. I'll go check. Now, Hisaka is more Ryo's type of woman, apparently. Because he's willing to talk to her and actually do her a favor. I keep telling you, stay out of here. How'd that bum get in here anyway? No idea. Here's evil in real life. Are you all right? Yeah. Young man. Sure's a cold day, eh? Don't suppose you'd buy an old man a can of coffee, eh? Sure. So we're gonna go around and do kindness to strangers, I guess, while we wait for it to be late. I guess I'll take this over to him. Here. Oh. Oh. That's so warm. <laughs> Much obliged, young man. Mister, where do you live? In this here harbor. Long about three years, I reckon. Really? Well, take care of yourself. All right, where's that girl's sister? Here she is. Mai. What are you doing? Mai, your sister's worried about you. Let's go home. Who the hell is this? Screw off, asshole! Whoa. Kiss off! Not so bright, are you? Bastard! I'm gonna kick your ass! You shouldn't play with stuff like this. What are you doing? I'm not going to preach to you, Mai. But you shouldn't treat your sister that way. Not family. Ryo is an equal opportunity no. ass kicker. We 
all part of a human family. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna need some of that hippie shit you're smoking, Sky Knight. <laughs> uh. You should remember that when he breaks the next guy's spine. How did it go, Dio? I beat the shit out of her friends. Not sure, but it's her decision. By the way, Hisaka-san. What is it? Are you single? Do you know the old warehouse district? Yes, I do. Oh, it's a bit far. Oh. It's just up the street. We already... I have to go make a delivery there now. Really? Yes, to the security office there. The security office? Hisaka-san? I could make the delivery for you. Oh, really? That'd be a great help. They've already paid. All right. But... What? There are only 10 security guards, but they always order 12 meals. I wonder why. Two people are extra Two hungry. Extra meals? Well, here it is, Ryo. Solved it. That, one, that was easy, lady. Excuse me. Hoko Hoko lunches? Huh, you! I have a delivery. Twelve lunches? Oh uh, yeah. Just put them there. Okay. Ugh, now I kind of want to go, like, get a gas station lunch. Twenty to twenty-one. You're on duty in the new warehouse district from 8 p.m. to? Yeah. Man, guess we'll be short-handed here again? As if the night shift isn't busy enough. Yeah, I know, I'd have to walk out in that shit. But it's less than five hey, minutes. you're still here? If you're done, go on, get out! Yes. Between 8 and 9 p.m. That's my chance. I made a joke about goggles, Evil. I said, what do you want me to do, He's wear goggles? Son. I'm done. Have any trouble finding it? Not really. You've been a big help. Thank you, y'all. Anytime. Uh, all right. So we gotta we gotta make it to 8 p.m. Like ski goggles. I could buy some, I guess. Or snorkeling. I should buy some ski goggles so I can wear them on my way to work on cold mornings. Help keep my eyes from freezing shut. Probably a decent idea. What else is there to do around the warehouse district where we could kill some time? Well, yeah, but I don't actively, like, harm myself so I can have stories to tell, Sky Knight. Let's see what's at the tomato store. Oh yo, now this 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 place is 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 fucking cool. I I'd, I'd hang out here. We got darts and neo darts. What is the difference? Neo darts doesn't look as fun as darts. Let's play some darts. Oh, and we got gotcha toys. We got everything here. I love these. Yo, I want a car. I should buy one. Uh, 
I got a motorcycle. This is cool. I got a little motorcycle dude. Is that the ha is that a hang on character? It is. Maybe I should get another. Yeah. This is cool. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nice car. There's a little Volkswagen. Maybe I should get another. Absolutely. Oh. Uh, not another Deodecohedron, or whatever these things are called. Maybe I should get another. Yep. I got plenty of money. This is cool. Hell yeah, a little moped. I should try again. This again? Ugh, damn it. I didn't need two Volkswagens. Maybe I should get another. Huh? 16 ton. Maybe right. I should get another. No, no, no. We have to stop. I'll we pass. We have to stop. Because this one on the... Oh, right here has love other prizes. Maybe just one. This is cool. This is... This, what is this? Like a, a poppin' twin bee enemy? Coba Beach. That didn't look like a beach. Maybe I should get another. Just one more. You got the same one twice. This again? Maybe I should get another. Just one more. I gotta get a new one. <laughs> it's the same one. <laughs> okay, hold on. Just uh, one more. I gotta get a new one. I should try again. This again? Oh, god damn it, I already had that one. Give me another one. I should try again. It's the same one. No, I got that out of the other one. I should try again. Yes, I gotta get a, something new. This is cool! Got something new. Finally. I should try again. No, okay, we have to stop. Nah, not today. 100 yen per play. I need some music.
Uh, let's listen to Dandy Old Man. This this goes out to evil. Perfect. All right. Uh, let's play some darts. Can I play darts? Darts. One game, 100 yen. I'll play it once. Guys, I'd like to point out that 100 yen is basically a dollar. No, good. Basically. The exchange rate isn't that exact, but... No, good. Oh, this is the worst hand of darts I've played in a while. Hey, not too bad. Come on, I want the double bullseye. No, good. This is the last dart. I'm getting it. The best. Well, I got I got the new high no score. More darts. Now play again. I'll give it another try. This is how we waste time. By playing playing darts and wasting our money. It's how I waste time in real life. So close. Sounds prophetic. No good. God damn it. Not too bad. Come on, double bullseye. Give me the double bullseye. All right. Hell yeah. Last one. No good. I want a free game. Cool. All right. Come on, double bullseye. So close. Damn it. No good. Too early. I'm getting it. All right. Hell yeah. All right. Come to Papa. This is it. No good. Damn it. So this is the last free game. Well, try beating my score, dickheads. The top score on this thing was 77 before I got here. No good. So 
so close. No, good. Oh, come on. Yeah, that's the way. Last one. Yeah. Oh, well, I'll take it. The best. Game over. All right, that's enough darts for now. We're getting there. Maybe it's next time. Almost six. We got just a few more hours to kill. You know, I'm gonna buy some canned tuna for the cat. I don't need this. Wait, why? For the cat. I don't need it. Oh wait, did I pick the wrong option? Did I pick don't buy instead of the- Okay, hold on. There we go. I'll take this, please. Yeah, sure. Thank you very much. How much yen did I have before I walked into this please come again. store? Just curious. A hundred K. I didn't have a hundred K. One. Holy shit. I got a magic can. What do I win? Ooh. Ah, good. What do I win? Belches later. Well, you win that <laughs> regardless. Excuse me. Yes. What is it? I have a winning can. Whoa! Hey there, good looking. Haven't I seen you on TV? You're that pop singer. Sorry, wrong guy. I'm just a kid. What do I do with a winning can? Hold on. Winning can. Congratulations. Use it to earn one free drawing at a store raffle. Oh, I have to use it at a store with a raffle. This store doesn't have a raffle. Oh, uh, shit. Yeah, yes, they do. Hey. Hey, I, I have a can. Alright, hold on. I think I know what to do. Yeah, sure. Thank you very much. I'll take this, please. Sure, draw a raffle ticket. No win. God damn it, so you no get a prize, eh? You have to get a winning can, and then you have to win again to even get anything out of it. I feel like quoting Tommy Wiseau and saying, That's life. Have you guys seen The Room? I 
I need to see the room. Maybe we'll watch it on movie night some night. It's so bad. It's like embarrassing <laughs> how bad that movie is sometimes. Yes, it is. Excuse me. Hello. Are you busy, Hisaka-san? Well, it's not so bad, I'd say. I see. I'm in a hurry, so... Okay, see you later. I feel like there's more of a connection between Ryo and Hisaka-san than there is between Ryo and Noizumi. I mean, not much more of a connection, but, you know, just a little bit more of a connection. Alright, sorry, I was just checking something. Alright, here, let's, uh... While we wait for it to be time for us to go to the warehouse, let me show you that last Red Box song. I'm gonna unpause the game, I'm just gonna mute it, and then we'll... I'll show you guys this Red Box song while we wait. It's called Pale Blue Pale Blue Dot. And it should be easy easy enough even Sky Knight could surmise what the song is about, hopefully. Hopefully. Alright, let me get this on screen.
So there you go. All right, and it's almost eight o'clock, so let's head over to the old warehouse district. This area is kind of creepy after dark. It's time. It's time for Metal Gear. Uh, hello. Oh. Whew, that was close. Okay, now's my chance. Huh? There's some writing. Warehouse number six. No, not here. Security guards. I can't let them catch me. I'm very tempted to put on Metal Gear music right now. I'm not going to. to find warehouse number eight while avoiding detection. Five, I see four over there. Ten. Oh Jesus, these fuck You there, what you doing? Nothing. Well, I'm, I, I'm just as good at this as I am Metal Gear. He's friggin' fast. Good thing that dude didn't feel like pursuing me. You, there. Fuck, what he was doing? right behind me. How, how? Not here. I'll get caught. Damn, where did he go? I don't know. <laughs> God, good God. Thankfully, these guys aren't very smart. Who are you? Wait! No, 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 no. You there, what you doing? I was hiding. You were, weren't supposed to be able to find me. Hey, hold still. God damn it. Don't you dare come in again. It's no good. I'll try again tomorrow. 
Thankfully, this game is kind enough to just jump you to, like, the next day. What is going on here that they need security guards patrolling these warehouses? Something scummy. Or else two. We're gonna follow this guy. Don't turn around. Rio, maybe turning your flashlight off would help you sneak around. Just a little bit of advice. So are these cops, like, walking around in high heels? <laughs> Good for your calves. Sounds painful. Don't see me. You, there! What you doing? You no. there. What you doing? I'm not doing anything. Hold on. Who's that? What are you doing here? Come here. <laughs> the one situation Rio doesn't fight his way out of. I won't be so nice next time. Damn, another day wasted. It's no good. I'll try again tomorrow. It's snowing today. Run. Run, 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 run. Alright, this is warehouse 10. What's back this way? Nothing. The people who arranged these warehouses were like, yeah, fuck it. Let's not put them in numerical order. Let, let, let future generations suffer when they have to, like, sort this shit out. Found it. I found it. Go in. I'm so glad the door's not locked. All that security and no, they didn't bother locking the doors. What is this? More cool, creepy music. Just stomp your way up every step. Excuse me. Uh, Chen-san? It won't open. We're about to get horror movie murdered. I wonder what it's used for. Can we open? Can we like open this? Lots of pots in here. 
Are there any clues about Master Chen? What kind of box is this? What's inside here? I don't know, check. Ah! Uh. Who's there? Wait, Guizang. What? Mr. Chen. Master Chen? You are the young man who has called? Yes, Ryo Hazuki. This says, if you ever need help, seek the aid of Master Chen. May I look at the letter? Sure. Yes, this is Zhu's handwriting. But it appears this letter arrived too late. Yes. This Zhu Yonda, how does he know my father? Zhu and your father brought back a certain mirror from China. The mirror? The one that man stole? It was stolen? Yes, the man who killed my father, Lan Di. Lan Di. Do you know him? Well, I know of him. An organization called Qi Yo Men. Its leader goes by that name. I hear he's a master of a deadly martial art. Yes, he used a style I've never seen. I think we mean the same person. What does this mean? Please tell me why my father... You needn't tell this boy anything, father. Father? No, I'm bound by my promise to Zhu Yuan Da regarding this boy's father. But... But... Was only one mirror stolen? Huh? I'm asking if only one mirror was stolen. Yes, made of stone, a dragon design. If so, then there's one more. I believe the phoenix mirror. Phoenix? A mythical bird of Chinese legend that guards human life. That mirror? My house? Perhaps. Find it. And then we'll talk. Yes, when I do, I'll return. From now on, telephone beforehand. And remember the password. Okay, the Phoenix Mirror must be somewhere in our house. It's my only lead, so I must find it. O okay. So we're searching around the house for the Phoenix Mirror. Um... What time is it? Six? Alright. Uh, you know what? I think this is probably a good spot to save for now. We've made decent progress. We know what we have to do next time we play. Search for the mirror. So yeah, uh, let me save this and we will wrap up the stream for tonight. All right. Uh, thanks, everyone, who came tonight. It was fun. And uh, we'll be back Monday with Xenogears.
Maybe we'll f reach disc two finally. <laughs> we didn't reach disc two of this game yet. All right, anyway. Good night, guys. Thanks for coming by. And uh, I'll be back Monday.